pretty good. No, I, I'm weirdly, I don't like it, but I agree with you because I went in the new S90 the other day and the interior is superb. Look, we've got a picture of it here. And yes, the thing about one. it is, they use pale colours. They've got pale coloured seats, pale coloured carpets, pale wood, and that makes it feel light and airy and spacious. Yeah. The only problem is that in one of those, you couldn't enjoy a chocolate magnum ice cream. <laughs> it's all right, I don't eat ice cream. I think something to do with being straight. <laughs> oh, oh, are you applauding it? What's that? What do you mean? Are you saying everyone who likes ice cream? Well, I mean, so ice, ice cream is a bit, you know. You're saying all children are homosexual. No. <laughs> but I mean, there's nothing wrong with it, but a grown man eating an ice cream, it's, you know, it's a bit, it's that, it's that way rather than that way. It just, <laughs> it is. Welcome to the inside of Richard Hammond's head. I'm right. I can't believe you is, can't see that. It's a fact, it's easy. It's in front of you. You could enjoy a 99 in there. You mean a 69? No, no. 99. But you couldn't have the chocolate thingy. My case rests. Oh, the chocolate thing. Do I? I think so. Exactly. No, but if you, if you had a Volvo, if you had that Volvo, you could have a white Magnum. True. Or a Milky Bar. Yeah, but not a double decker. Well, a flake is worse. No, double decker is worse. <laughs> double no. decker. Every, we, do you all know what I mean by the double decker, right? Because it is unique among chocolate confectionery items. Take a bite as you're driving along, and a bit about this big, okay, silently breaks away. <laughs> Goes down between your legs. And melts. <laughs> so when you get out of the car, everybody thinks you've some kind of trouser accident. <laughs> big brown stain. Right? I know what you mean. It's, I, I do know what you mean. Yeah, yeah. A flake is worse. No, I mean, it's, it just is. A flake is advertised as the crumbliest, flakiest chocolate. It is worse. This is a hot topic on Conversation It is. And I think we should settle it here and now. I'm going to go into our travelling box. Travelling box of chocolate confectionery, and I'm going to let's settle it. Competition, yes. Yeah. I'm going to give you James's flake, the flake. you the double decker. Right, so I'll just turn that over so that we'll see yeah. how much spills off as I eat the flake. Yeah. Not much, right? This is scientific. Here we go. Oh, yeah. some of it's already crumbed. This is cheating. This one. <laughs> okay, no, no, clear away the debris. No, no, I need to. Jesus. No, that's, that's part of eating it. It isn't part of eating it. I haven't even begun yeah, now. You've got to unwrap it. Shh. Cheat. Only the crumbliest, flakiest chocolate. Oh, God. Tastes like chocolate. What? Jeremy, you know that advert, girl in, the... <laughs> girl in the Field of Poppies? We're not seeing that right now. I am. No, I'm not. Right, ready? Watch this. He's going in. First bite. Oh, it's a big ball of chocolate. Mm. It's a spring. It's a heavy sprinkling. Mm. Huh? Well, it's a light dusting of chocolate. A light either. dusting, yeah. Okay. Right, James May. Moving over to this corner, James May and his double decker. This is exciting, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> this is a great car program. Groundbreaking really. stuff. Yeah. Quiet, please. I can't believe. <laughs> I can't believe this hasn't been done before. <laughs> He's going in. He's taking a bite. He's poured on that. His teeth. So there we are. Using science, we have now established. If you've got a Volvo, don't have a double decker. Ever. Or an ice cream, because he. Oh, no, forget it. Let's.